Did you know there's a lake in Australia that disappears for years, then suddenly floods without a single drop of local rain? It's called Lake Eyre and it breaks almost every rule of geography. Lake Eyre, also known as Katitanda, is in South Australia. It's the largest lake in the country and sits 15 meters below sea level. But here's the twist. It's usually bone dry, covered in salt. So how does it flood? Water from distant rains in Queensland travels over 1,000 kilometers through rivers like Cooper Creek and the Diamantina. That journey can take weeks or months. When it finally arrives, the desert turns into a shallow inland sea. And that's not all. Tens of thousands of birds appear almost instantly. Pelicans, banded stilts, and gulls. Scientists still don't know how they sense the water. No alerts, no weather radar, just instinct. Quiz time. How often does lake air completely fill? A. Every year. B. Every 10 years. C. Just a few times per century. Comment your guess below. Answer. C. Only around four major floods in the past 100 years. If you love learning how nature works in ways textbooks never taught, subscribe to Snackable Geography. Explore our playlist. Geography. A to Z, snack size facts from every country. Hit the next video because this lake isn't the only place rewriting the map.